one of these days I'm going to get my shit together and it's recording, of course, while I'm saying this. <laughs> these are great, like, uh, oh, you like outtake them? clips. Mm -hmm. I really do. I enjoy... I leave them. I know you do sometimes. Make it sometimes genuine like... as hell. <laughs> Hey! Hi! Welcome to The Green Hangout, where we are a podcast, Fifty Shades of Green, and we literally just like talk about all of the ways that we use cannabis in our lives, or how it is a part of our lives. How it helps our lives, affects our lives, everything. We're vibrating. Whoopsie, sorry. I'm stuck. <laughs> We're so back. <laughs> today we are going to be talking with Jane West, the, the one and only. Yes. So her Instagram is the Jane West. Okay. So the Jane West has pre-filled chillums. Yeah. Chillums. So they're like one hitters, and they're pre-filled at Fluent, and I'm obsessed with them. I love. Them. I don't know if you've tried them. I haven't them. tried them yet, but I've seen you post about them. Super convenient. I actually like them better than pre rolls. Really? Yeah, because pre rolls sometimes will like will get fucked up, and these okay, don't. Good. Anywho, so here's the sneak peek clips of our podcast episode with the Jane West. And next time you see us, we will be recording. Inside. Bye. Bye. There's a guy behind us. I know. I know. <laughs> I mean, uh, I don't even know how to work the damn Zoom, so should we switch these for this episode? Uh, you would just hit, you would literally just hit start call, and that will get us in there. Mm -hmm. I just have the Wi-Fi. I don't know if you it is. Sure. Okay. There. You click it here? Yeah, I'm gonna click outside of here? it first. No. What am I doing? <laughs> oh, I thought I was outside of it. What video is it? Up I'm top. Not too familiar. Top right. Here. Where the little paper clip looking thing is. Yep. Okay. Yeah. Once you guys go wreck, then like everything is so different. We have partners in 13 states and five provinces of Canada. And so I've been there with partners as the markets went from a more medical market to a recreational market and you know sales in many cases are like 10x and there's just a why there's a lot of people that um, just don't want to go through all the headache of what you you both are going through in terms of getting your medical card. My favorite thing though and everyone that I show this to the number one thing they say Oh my gosh, the stopper. That yeah. little black yeah. stopper. I don't know why everyone's so obsessed with it. But oh, it I was like, oh, look at this. They're like, oh my gosh, yes. the stopper. Well, it helps you like plan ahead for on the go when like you're like, okay, this is what I want, but yeah. I don't want it. Like it's the beach. So this what so you know, I'm gonna pack it up and be ready to go. And also like you're you know, you when you're, you're just like none of it's bad. Like it's just not bad. Like there's not information we're getting. We're like, oh, but this one really bad thing, you know, like we're and here in Colorado, I think more people just need to be armed with the right talking points. Yeah. I mean, some people just aren't going to listen. Yeah. And they, they have their opinion. And a lot of that, I think sometimes is based on a person or someone in their lives that maybe like that used cannabis and, and whatnot, but um, they just don't realize how many people really well, you know? And so, um, and like once, it, it, if you're armed with the right talking points and you have someone who is maybe receptive to listening, um, when you take a look in Colorado, at like, like our roads are just as safe as they were before legalization. Like the teen, overall teen use of all illicit drugs is down. I've heard. Because right. that, like, that like drug dealer model that then they had like other things to sell you right. um, is broken. Yes. And, the people that like have the money and doing the thing like are the ones right there and then all of a sudden people are looking around they're like wait what i wanted to do this too right how can i you know and so and there's a lot of um people just intentionally trying to confuse the market 
Um, the thing there's the most of right now is people saying the words like equity and women's initiatives, but yeah. like nothing about their business shows that in any way, shape or form other than the words they're saying out loud. Or their Instagram um, logo. <laughs> right. And so, so um, just like, you know, we are the next generation of customers here. And, you know, I just got like such amazing feedback um, from everything related to Fluent. And I've had such a great time getting to know their team that um, is all like really diverse and awesome and supportive. And they're all there in Miami. And um, you have to just do your best to like find the best partners. And hey guys, this may be our last video. <laughs> Wait, which way? The same? Let's do this way so we can see if Debbie's coming. Ready? Oh, sorry about your movie. <laughs> okay, so we actually didn't get to record. I don't have very much recording time left. I'm sorry. We forgot to also record the Zoom. I love you, but we'll provide clips, sneak peeks. Maybe I'll do extra long ones, okay? Bye. Thank you. Love you. Don't forget to follow us on social media and Instagram. The I only have hangout. 30 seconds. So at the green hangout, I'm Pothead Mom. I'm 50 Shades of J. We'll see you next week. Yay! Bye.